Hi guys and welcome back to the vlog. Happy Vlogmas Day 2 and today Adam Body Works has a sale with the candles. With the three-way candles that everybody loves and it's like $25. It's like super expensive. It's $10 today. So that's a big sale to be honest for Bath & Body Works. I think we're gonna go there. It's a little bit cold today. Like literally I can feel it through the windows. And I kind of want to wear my Uggs. I can't wait because I've always been wanting these as you saw in the last vlog and these just look so warm and comfy so I think I'm just gonna go ahead and wear them today oh they look so cute and comfy I love them honestly they're very comfy and very warm Whew, it's cold today I think you can see the smoke coming out of my mouth bitch wear <laughs> These are like walking on clouds. I know I keep talking about them, but they're so comfy. Oh my god, why? I don't know why I never got Uggs like this before. Also, I'm trying to finish this water bottle before I get my first coffee of the day because I've been dehydrating myself too much too often and that's no good. That way we can be ahead of hydration and not be dehydrated. There's a whole line to buy the money works. There's a whole line. And I just want two candles. Just two. That's okay. We have coffee and we're just warm, so we're just gonna wait. Made it inside. Alright. Let's get looking and smelling these candles. Here's the thing. My main thing is I want to get my Christmas tree scented candles and I only want two so I really have to choose them. So these are the candles that I might take. I need to take one of these. So this is winter, ice winter balsam, fresh balsam, vanilla balsam, and magani balsam. And there's under the Christmas tree. They all smell like Christmas tree. We're going to go ahead and smell all of them and see which one I end up with. Um, that's the goal, but I do want a Christmas tree scented candle. We're gonna try the Magani one. This one's very good, but it's very like scented. So it doesn't really taste like Christmas tree, but it's actually really good. Then we have Vanilla Balsam, which of course smells like vanilla, but it's actually also really good because it does smell like Christmas tree. Then we have Fresh Balsam, which is like the regular Christmas tree scented one that everybody here talks about. But this one is way too strong. I don't know. I feel like this one doesn't really sound like Christmas tree to me. It's very fragrancy, so I don't know. I don't really like that one. That's a no for me. And then we have iced winter balsam. This one's like the fresh balsam, but more subtle. So this one's really good. I actually do like this one. So we also have the under the Christmas tree. But that one's very subtle, so no, but I'm torn between vanilla balsam and ice winter balsam. I think be one of these. Then guys, the crush candy cane, it smells so good. It's like a legit candy cane, but they don't have it in a big one, they only have a small one, so it's not really worth it to buy the small one right now. But they did have the twisted peppermint one, which is something similar to it. So I think I'm gonna get this one and I think I'm gonna get one of the balsams. So I'm only here for two because I don't burn candles like that. That's why I'm like, you know, I'm not gonna sell meat, but it's still a good deal. This is so cute. Oh, candle holder. Alright, so here's everything that I ended up getting from Bath and Body Works. Um, so yeah, they have a little sale. I only got two because, like I said, I don't burn them like that. It's better for me if I just buy two and stick to them and then see how that goes. But I ended up getting the Winter Iced Balsam. This one was one of the best ones for me because it wasn't so strong and so scented. And it's just like perfect. I also got the Wallflower for the Mahogany Balsam. So if I don't like that, I'll just use the Wallflower. And then I got the Twisted Peppermint. This one smells like a candy cane. So this one's really good and it's like... You know, Christmassy vibes, this is what I want. I wanted a Christmas candle, so these are perfect. And then I ended up getting 
five hand sanitizers. It's all Christmassy themed. Vian Westwood. Uh, look at the Christmas tree. It's Coach, Christmas tree, A, and the T Rex. Made out of like all leather bags. So pretty. So bougie. Look, I find these so adorable, the little ones. They're like smaller version of those big ones right there. But they're also unnecessary because I don't feel like you can't fit much. So, but they're cute, I guess. I love this yellow couch. They got the Disney ones here too. Aww. Miss Disney. Rawr. Okay, so I'm literally debating whether I should go to the Vivian Westwood shop and stop by and look at the necklace maybe, the one that I've been wanting. It's like the mini brass. I'm gonna put a picture of it right here, but this is literally I've been wanting this necklace for so long. I've been buying the dupes for so long too, and I feel like I've added them up, because I already bought it like four times, and they're like $30 each on Etsy, like the good quality ones, the dupe ones, and I feel like I've added up to like make up the worth of the actual one, so in a way, I feel like it's better if I just buy the real one and I don't know should I should I get it I don't know it's just like I feel like I've been spending so much money but I feel like I really 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 love this necklace and if you know me personally you know that I always wear this necklace and I love this necklace Ooh. okay we're back and I think the damage will be done supposed to be from here so I'm giving you a quick sneak peek of Vivian Westwood's the men's section <laughs> they're all naked I don't know you can no you can't zoom in but uh so weird oh heading over for dinner now but first we're gonna make a quick stop into crumble cookies it's one of those like I don't know all the Instagram influencer girlies have been talking about crumble cookies and I've been wanting to try it so today's the day we're gonna get to try it. I made it. I'm so packed. Must be really good. <laughs> These are all the flavors. We got milk chocolate, gingerbread, lemon crinkle. We got classic pink sugar, Boston cream pie, and green mint. And this is what they look like. We got the goods. They look like. Ah. Looks so good. And so now to ramen for some dinner. We got the Naruto soup. We got the Mega Naruto, and then we're just waiting on the rice. And the rice is finally here, but this rice, so good. It's called pork fried rice with Naruto on it. It's really good. Okay, and now for the moment you probably been waiting for and you probably clicked on the video for the Vivian Westwood unboxing of the necklace. This is the original Vivian Westwood necklace. Comes in the box, says Vivian Westwood. And then it comes in a little, oh, a little dust bag, oh. It comes with a little Saturn logo, and then inside is the pearl necklace. This one's called the mini brass. It's the Vivian Westwood mini brass pearl necklace. This is what it looks like. It's much more shinier. And then also, if you notice here, the rhinestones are, um, I think he said it was like topaz, or it was like a matchy color with the actual gold and then you can't really see but the, the pearls itself they're not white they're actually like a creamish color but this is what she looks like and then i asked him to get me an extender because they tried on in store and it was a little bit too tight but this is what it looks like without the extender but this is what she looks like on it's so cute and i must say it is a little bit tight on me like literally right on the neck so i don't know <laughs> i don't know if like my double chin is gonna be like in the way i pretty much like it a lot and this is what it looks like with the extender on which is much better for me i feel like it's just not choking me literally i know it's a choker but it's not supposed to literally choke you so i feel like this is why this much is much much better it fits like right under the neckline so i think i'm gonna be wearing it with the extender even though it's a little you know a little whack but like Everybody that knows me knows that I always wear the this one. Um, 
And I do have the silver, the dupe, for, the dupe version. I don't think I will be getting the, the real one because like one is enough. Hopefully it lasts, but I kind of got it. I'm so happy for it. Although I'm not gonna lie, I kind of wish that the pearls, like the little rhinestones on the Saturn were also silver just like the dupe, but it is what it is. But the moment we've all been waiting for, the crumble cookie taste testing. We have the chocolate chip, the gingerbread, the Boston cream, and this is the... I'm gonna put it down here, but this is what they are. Um, and I can't wait to try them. I know Remy and like a lot of LA girls been raving about these cookies, so I can't wait to try them. So heard they're very buttery though, and very sweet. So I think we're gonna start off with the chocolate chip. Mmm, it's good. It kind of reminds me of a Levain cookie. It's not bad, but Levain is still better though. The two chips is really better. We're gonna try the gingerbread. Oh my god. <laughs> it literally has gingerbread um, crumbs. Oh, This one's very good, but it's just very sweet, to be honest. I love that the gingerbread is not like so strong. Boston cream. I am not a big fan of Boston cream, but... I'm gonna try it out just because of the sake of this cookie. This is very soft. This is like very spongy. Not my favorite, honestly. Okay, and lastly, we have the classic pink sugar. It looks like this. It's just like pink icing, honestly. And it's like a sugar cookie on the bottom, so cheers. Mmm. This one's good. They are very sweet, very sugary, and very buttery, for sure. Boston cream was not my favorite, to be honest, but the pink one was actually good. The gingerbread man, surprisingly, was a really good one. It's just very sweet. Of course, chocolate chip, my favorite. But they're actually good. It's just very sweet. But Levain, still a winner. Sorry, I totally forgot to end the vlog, but I hope you guys enjoy. And give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And let me know down in the comments below what kind of more vlogs do you want to see this holiday season. I know I still have many more to come. They're a little backed up, but they're coming. And then we're doing 12 days of Vlogmas starting December 12th to the 24th. And I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you tomorrow on the next vlog. Bye.